Hi, how are you today, Professor? Hi, good. Um, I'm Dr. Ray Hong, and I teach genetics and developmental biology here at CSUN. And so, um, do you do research here as well? Yes, we do. And I have a lab next door, and we work on tiny, worm-like invertebrates called nematodes. And I work on one that's actually found in beetles. And they have a very simple nervous system, like 300 neurons. But because they have a simple nervous system, uh, we can see how they're connected and how genes can play a major role in their behavior. And so we can actually also genetically manipulate these nematodes. We can put transgenes in there. We can actually do genome editing through CRISPR-Cas. You may have heard of that. And so in my lab, students get to do behavior assays, molecular biology, and microscopy, and genome editing. How do students get research experience? So students ought to start early and ask their professors in 106 and 107 what kind of research opportunities um, are there and if they're interested in particular topics they can recommend those professors can recommend um, particular professors to ask and you should do a little bit of research on those professors on our websites uh, we have both the departmental website and our own websites um, and you can email them to ask if they have volunteer positions or maybe take a 495 independent research with them and um, maybe have you shadow one of their uh, more senior uh, students. Um, I also recommend that you think about getting paid while you're doing research once you decide that a lab lifestyle that is 10 to 12 hours per week, along with their other courses, is the right one for you. And if you do find that research is interesting, then you should apply for a build for their program or a, a what's called the URISE program that hopefully we'll be able to uh, have here uh, going at CSUN. Awesome, those sound like great opportunities. Uh, any words of wisdom for biology majors? I would say start early and time is short even though you think you have a lot of time when you start. Uh, once you decide your biology major, the next things to do is to, to do is to think about what options you want to have with your career, and also while you're here at CSUN, what kind of um, experiences you want to, um, to have in addition to the classes and extracurricular activities. And so research will be one area you want to explore. Wonderful. Anything else you'd like to add? Well, stay curious and stay, well, work, work hard. <laughs> <laughs> work hard, awesome. Yes. Excellent advice for anything in life, right? That's right, yeah. All right. Thank you, Dr. Hong. Students, you can visit him, take genetics with him or his developmental bio class, and say hi if you see him around. Thank you. Right. Thank you.